What is going on today in the UK is no different than what is going on in the United States of America. Same bloody thing. And that is what you are seeing is people on the top, people who are phenomenally rich are becoming richer. You're seeing a middle class continue to shrink and you're seeing millions and millions of people living in abject poverty. In the year 2022, we cannot allow that to happen, whether it's the UK or the United States. Working people all over this globe have got to stand together and tell the oligarchs they cannot have it all. It's not only inequality in wealth and income, it is a growing concentration of ownership. Again, the corporate media doesn't talk about this terribly much. But in sector after sector in the United States, and I doubt that it is much different here, you have a handful of large multinational corporations controlling what is produced and how much it costs in one area after the other. And right now, there are three firms on Wall Street, BlackRock, State Street, and Vanguard, who have and control, control assets of $20 trillion dollars, three companies, that is the GDP of the United States of America. And these three companies are major stockholders in 95% of the Standard & Poor's 500 corporation list. So what you are looking at globally is a small number of billionaires who have enormous power over the economic life of the people and the political life of the people. And our challenge is to bring people together, to stand up to the demagogues who want to divide us up by the color of our skin or where we were born or our sexual orientation or whatever. Bring working people together in the fight for justice and a world that belongs to all of us, not just the people on top.